There's a lot of conversation and controversy in the industry within muzzle loading. Do I shoot a Sabo bullet or do I shoot a bore size bullet? And the answer is there is no right or wrong answer. Depends on what you want to accomplish. If I want to shoot long range, have flat trajectory, have good terminal performance, I'm talking long range being 200 yards, you really have to go with a Sabo style bullet. And the reason being is the ballistics of this bullet are far superior than the ballistics for a bore size bullet. This is 45 caliber. It flies flatter. It's 250 grains. The terminal performance, all of the technology in centerfire rifle ammo, Hornady has put into their SST, which is also TC shockwave bullet. But you can also shoot a bore size bullet. This bullet is a 100 yard bullet, 125 yard bullet. But the advantage here, you can shoot a heavier projectile, 300 grains, 350 grains. So if I'm not worried about long range performance or I'm shooting dangerous game, I'm shooting a brown bear, I'm shooting a moose, something that can weigh a thousand pounds, this could be my bullet of choice. This happens to be the Hornady FFB bullet. It loads super simple. You don't have to worry about a plastic sabo. It slides right down the barrel. On the back of the bullet, there's a cup. So the gases fill this cup and the bullet obdurates or expands and fills the rifling and comes out your bore with superior accuracy. So again, there's no right or wrong answer. It depends on what you want to shoot. Big and dangerous game, big bore size heavy bullet, long range terminal performance, go with the Sabo. Easy to load because you don't have to worry about a Sabo. A little bit more difficult to load, but great long range terminal performance and the characteristics you see in all technology centerfire rifle bullets.